Sagittariuses are a sign that I really do get along with well. Astrologically, we get along well, and I just, I love being around Sagittarius people. When I first meet someone, I can tell before then if they're a Sagittarius. I just know that we're gonna like really hit it off. There's so much that I love about them. They love life. They love to explore. They're naturally adventurous. I just love that. I love that fun adventure type of thing. I love the, how they're intelligent. They're very, very intelligent. So all of your conversations with them are gonna be very deep and stimulating. They're very, they're built on a lot of substance. Evolved, e evolved Sagittarius have a lot of, you know, cream in their cream puff. Like they have a lot of substance in there. They talk about really deep, controversial, stimulating. And I like how they tell it how it is. They're very blunt and straight to the point. They're not gonna be, they're not gonna sugarcoat stuff with you and they don't do it to be mean or to hurt your feelings, they just, that's just who they are. You know, they just tell it like it is, just naturally. The aggravating thing about uh, Sagittarius is that, that they can be very annoying. They can be very aggravating and they can kind of just push things way to the damn limit. Like they will just overdo it with the aggravating and they don't even, they're not even conscious of it. They're also very, they're just, they lie a lot almost pathologically the way that these people lie is almost kind of miniature sociopath they they lie and don't think anything of it. i know that in the past i try not to lie now but i know in the past when i have lied i feel really shitty and really guilty about it because i always I'm, I'm about the truth i love to tell the truth and to just lie like that and really just kind of go along with it and be along with it is just not cool for me. It's kind of like murdering somebody and not feeling guilty about it. Not having any remorse, like, oh well, they needed to die anyway. That kind of thing. Um, they also have a really hard time committing, so if you are in a relationship with a Sagittarius, they either really, really love you or they're thinking about who they're gonna be doing the next. The settle down type. Now, this is not for everybody, but the majority, you know, of people. And I'm not gonna say that just because you're not, you're non-committal that you're a thot or you're a hoe, but you just don't wanna commit. You don't want to be tied down, if that makes sense. You know, I know that there are a lot of Sagittarius out there who are married and they are very happy. Uh, my dad is married, he's been married for 20 years, but you know, that's the evolved part of being a Sagittarius. I hope you guys really, really enjoyed this video. I am gonna be doing so many more of these types of videos because I just love astrology. I just really do believe that astrology and how the the stars and the sun and the planets were aligned when you were born has a lot to do with the type of person you are, the type of people that you associate with, um, the type of career you choose, the type of mate that you choose. You know, of course, a lot of the influence that the influences that you grew up around, whether it be in a bad influence or the way you were raised, has a lot to do with you being the type of person you are as well. But I just feel like when we are equipped to know who we really, really are, we will know. We will have the tools to make ourselves better and that's what this type of thing is about so i hope you guys really really enjoyed this video please leave some comments below please like the video i want you to like the video so that you can just show youtube that this is what you want to look at i will see you guys on the next video and remember there is no change without challenge and i will see you guys again soon peace